Hi Dreamers, my name's Nightmares Liz and welcome to my first Game Review Thursday. This week we're going to talk about Destiny. Yes, Destiny, that, game's play that game that is playing in the background. Um, well, to sum up the beginning part of this game, you are a guardian awakened by a ghost after years of being dead. This darkness and other alien life form have taken over most planets, including Earth. The only safe haven left is the city, where it holds the tower, the home of the guardians. Now it's up to you, guardians, to help stop the darkness at, from continuing to spread. I mean, I'm a little sick. Um, <clears throat> well, if you also want to know more about the game, click on this Fallen's face to go visit the wiki of Destiny. Now, let's talk about gameplay, shall we? Destiny is an open world action role playing first person shooter, or as Bungie calls it, share our world shooter. Created by J Bungie and published by Activision. This game, ha as you know, is similar to games such as Borderlands and Halo, and some people also say Call of Duty. Bungie leaves um, the players in this game with the option of uh, playing uh, the story mission in the game or let them leave the story mission behind and goof around and level up and patrol. If patrol um, is not your thing, maybe you want to fight other players in crucible matches. Um, if not crucible, there are also these st weekly strike missions, also the strike um, playlist. <laughs> Bungie has never failed to bring more entertainment during this game and currently from September 25, which is today, um, to October 6, Queen Bounties and Missions will be held until then. So it's another dull moment for this game. Now what I want to go into is the pros of this game. Um, this is my opinion, you know, because this is my review of the game. Um, if you have your own opinion, feel free to elaborate on them down in the comments below. But for now, <coughs> number one, this game has awesome graphics in my opinion and never fails to make me forget about the mission and I will just suddenly stop and stare around. Guys, have you ever been to the speakers um, area and then just go over the little like dome at the bottom and to the balcony at the edge and just stare at the traveler and the lights down below especially in the nighttime or like where the sun sets it's just beautiful guys <sighs> yeah anyways number two character creation come on guys who doesn't love to, a good build your own character game and make them look hot sexy weird or cute or however you want <laughs> Like, I spent good hours, not hours, minutes, developing this character to make him or her look beautiful between either a human, a Woken, or an Exo. Third on the list of pros, um, the option of open world and having others around. Um, this feels less like a game with just like aliens and NPCs and more of an MMO. Well, obviously it is an MMO, but but uh, Bungie needs to fix some stuff, man. <coughs> well, at least you can interact with them like you, for now, dancing, the waving, chilling, you know. Fourth and last on the list of pros, this is a team slash friend slash buddy game. <laughs> I love this game because. <coughs> You're able to play with other, it's a more like team oriented game, like where you will have to, well you can play by yourself, but it's like recommending you play with other people and like friends or randoms, but it's hard if you don't have talking like, communication. <laughs> so it it's awesome to play with friends, mess around, or just feel accomplished between the three slash six people the group of friends you have in beating a raid. Now for the list of cons. This game has a tendency to log out some people. I personally haven't had this experience, but I know my friend has. Um, he, I, But they're patching it and they're patching so many other things too with this game. So I'm excited <laughs> so that he doesn't rage quit 
and pl like play something else. So that's one thing I would like to mention. Number two, this game requires internet, guys. And if you have terrible internet, good luck to you, dreamers. Good luck to you. <laughs> Third on the list is the lack of trading system in this game. I would really appreciate the if Bungie could patch that somehow let care like other players trade amongst each other because we run out of space really quickly especially if you're a hoarder for loot like me guns armor you can only hold so much bon uh, Bungie excuse me <coughs> that would be very nice and we appreciate it very much <laughs> um and last but not least the lack of loot I read somewhere recently today um, that they're also patching that too and also they're patching the voice communication for this game um, <laughs> but I expect that this is what it's currently at so I expected really a lot more loot from this game spending two nights trying to find a new pair of boots yeah I feel like such a loser <laughs> um, yeah so those are my pros and cons. Now some suggestions. As crazy as they may seem. Obviously, enough said, a trading system, please, Bungie. Pretty please. Um, this is a crazy idea, but we, me and my friends, thought of this was a pretty cool idea. If you guys can hold uh, an event where we can um, just randomly have a sparrow race. Like a mini game sparrow race. And the prize can be like something, like whatever, whatever you want, Bungie. Because it'll be, we could do our own Sparrow races, but there's no real benefit except for bragging rights. Because if we could share or trade between other people, we could also place bets ourselves. So you don't have to technically make a mini game. It's just a thought, you know? <laughs> And a patch for more loot, uh, which is already on its way. And a patch for communication between other players on in the game, rather. Uh, well, there is a communication, but it's hard. It's only for fire teams rather than, um, like, in general, chat. But for example, my friend is not on my fire team, but we're in the same area. There's no chat. <laughs> well, that's pretty much what I think about this game. I give this an 8 out of 10, guys. <laughs> I would give it a 10 out of 10, but I'm waiting for those patches. <laughs> um, so tell me what your thoughts and experience about Destiny. Leave the comments down below or tweet me at Nightmares Liz. And thank you guys so much for watching. Stay tuned for next week's game review. And remember to tiny smash that like button, subscribe, for or I will send the fallen after you. Mm -hmm. You don't know how I'm going to do it, but I will. <laughs> Palama la rosa. Game on, guys. Oh, <laughs>